Queensboro about to take on Kingsboro. These teams met on January 14th in Kingsboro, 166-64 on their home court. Queensboro tries to return the favor. Starting five for Queensboro, Latasha Harris, Nyasia Irby, Jacqueline Torres, Sabrina Rodriguez, and Precious Latham. Precious Latham will jump at half court against Carla Baina. Queensboro win the white. Queensboro is four and one in CUNY. Kingsboro four and two. Last year, Queensboro won in overtime on this court against Kingsboro. Loose ball. Good ball. And they'll jump again. Now Latasha Harris will jump against Latoya Kinlock. Tipped. And on the floor again, Sabrina Rodriguez with it. Latasha Harris. Jacqueline Torres for three. Torres airballs it. Chased down by Nyasia Irby who throws it out of bounds. Lady wave ball. The Lady Wave with it now. Game one of a doubleheader. Kristen Decoud. The cutest gives it up, and that's an air ball from Hillary Roman. Sabrina Rodriguez with it now, pushes it ahead. Nyasia Irby ahead of the pack, couldn't finish. And Latham touched it last. Kingsborough will have it. Kristen DeCutis brings it up, leading Kingsborough in assists per game with 3.4. Nice ball movement. Kinlock. Torres comes down with it. And traveling is called. Kingsborough will inbound. Harris. Harris pushes it. Blocking foul is called. Latasha Harris will go to the line for two. Also, a pronunciation, a clarification. Number five is Kristen DeCutis. First foul on Carla Baina. Harris hits the first free throw. One nothing, Lady Tigers. Harris sinks them both, it's 2-0. Decutis pushes it. Roman throws it out of bounds. Queensboro will get it back. Rodriguez. Latham. Latham takes it herself. Rebounded by Kinlock. Decutis pushes it up. Decides to slow it down. Rodriguez guarding her. Hillary Roman with it now to Kinlock. Kinlock for three. Decutis chases it down. Takes it herself. Misses a three. And Torres touches it last. Lady Wave get it in. Rodriguez tipped it. Decutis puts it up and it's good. Kristen Decutis with the first points of the game for Kingsboro and it's 2-2. Rodriguez to Latham. Latham can't finish and it's rebounded by Kristen Decutis.
Hillary Roman leading the Kingsborough in points. And again, it's thrown to Queensborough coach Bob DiNardo. Rodriguez will bring it up. Sabrina Rodriguez averaging 19.1 points per game. Latasha Harris. Irby shot is blocked, but Harris has it. To Rodriguez, 17 on the shot clock. Rodriguez off glass, it's good. Sabrina Rodriguez with their first points of the game. 4-2, Queensboro. Tipped. Hillary Roman for three. Rebounded by Latham. That would have given Kingsboro the lead. They get it right back. Hillary Roman. Now Latham has it for Queensboro. Almost threw it away. Irby has it. Gets it to Harris now. Good ball denial by Allison Ahmad, but Sabrina Rodriguez has it to Irby. Irby misses, rebounded by Kinlock. They cute us with it. Hillary Roman to Baina. They cute us. Kinlock. Kinlock ties the game. Kinlock. 5-4, Kingsboro. Stolen, Kinlock. And not sure what that was. Just throw it out of bounds, really. Queensboro with it. Queensboro 5-4, Lady Wave lead the Lady Tigers. QCC looking for the lead. Rodriguez to Torres for three. Rebounded. Out of bounds. Out of bounds to KCC. They cued us. Averaging 11.2 points per game. Guarded by Rodriguez. Hamad gets it to Johnson. Good ball movement. Carla Baina. Baina makes it 7-4 Kingsboro. Rodriguez to Latham. Turn around. Traveling is called. Bob DiNardo calls for timeout. 30 second timeout called by Queensboro. With 15.37 to go in the first half, Kingsboro leads 7-4. Also a note on Kristen DeCutis. Second in points on Kingsboro, first in assists. She was a co-captain for the Scholars Academy last year, which won the PSAL championship. Team was coached by Janet Kleiner. Her first PSAL title as a coach. Bit of a sloppy start for Queensboro. Four points in the first four minutes and 23 seconds. Kristen calling out the play. Ahmed misses. In the lane, blocked by Rodriguez. Rodriguez pushing. Off glass, it's good. Sabrina Rodriguez with four points. 7-6, KCC. Five minutes in, Baina hits. Baina with four points. 9-6, KCC. Rodriguez. Dribbling a lot, then gets it to Torres. Fakes a three, now takes, shoots an air ball. Kinlock with it. Wild sequence, got it to Shakaya Johnson. Good ball movement. 
Baina hits. It's a two. Carla Baina, who's averaging 9.4 points per game with six early points. Rodriguez to Torres for three. Missed, tipped. KCC controls it. Kristen walks it across half court. Kinlock, that's a three, air balls it. And Acutis is fouled. Foul is on Naasia Irby, her first. Misses the first. Misses them both, rebounded by Rodriguez, and then stolen by Kinlock, but out of bounds, it'll go to QCC. Tigers substitution, number 32, Tiana Jean Lewis, replacing number 33, Jacqueline Torres. Rodriguez. Shakai Johnson guarding her. Elise Langley to Latasha Harris. Harris throws up a wild one, out of bounds to Kingsborough. Kristen gets to play from her bench. The Wave lead 11-6. Lady Wave leading the Lady Tigers. Johnson, good defense and a steal by Rodriguez. Rodriguez, off glass. Rodriguez now with six points. It's 11-8, Kingsborough. And a 30-second timeout is called by Kingsborough. It's a 30 second timeout. Scoring for Queensboro, Sabrina Rodriguez has six, Latasha Harris with two. Carla Baina leading the way for the Lady Way with six. Latoya Kinlock has three, Kristen DeCutis has two. Bringing it up, 13 minutes to go in the first half. Queensboro in the zone defense. Tipped. Rodriguez wrecking havoc defensively. Kinlock off glass, it's good. Latoya Kinlock now with five points. 13-8, Kingsboro. Latasha Harris. Good ball denial by Kingsboro. Keanu Jean Lewis. Rebounded by Latham underneath. She was too far underneath the basket. And Acutis. Long pass to Baina. Back to Acutis. Off glass, it's a two. Acutis now has four points. 15-8, Kingsboro. Rodriguez. Pass was too high for the four foot eight Langley. Kingsborough with it now. Allison Ahmad to Baina. Off to. That shot was off. Latasha Harris crosses half court. Harris. It's good. Latasha Harris now with four points. 15-10, KCC. Kristen DeCutis, stolen by Rodriguez. And Rodriguez finishes at the other end. Now with eight points. 
Rodriguez is averaging six steals per game. 15-12. Kinlock, off glass, it's good. Kinlock now with seven. Great pass, I don't know how it even made it to Kinlock. Harris now with it. Sabrina Rodriguez, Langley. And Langley is fouled. First foul on Kinlock. Langley looking for her first points. Hits the first. 17-13, Lady Wave lead. Brown, and for QCC, number 33, Jacqueline Torres. Wayne Lee misses the second. Queensboro rushing to get back on defense. They cue this. Threw up a really long shot, rebounded by Latham. Harris. Nice pass to Keanu Jean Lewis to Latham. Shot is short, rebounded by Baina. Essence Brown gives it to DeCutis. Brown. Shot is off, rebounded by Harris. Harris lost it. Kingsborough will have it. Halfway through the first. 17-13, Kingsborough. Queensborough in a 2-3. Brown fakes Baina. Pulled down by Torres. Jacqueline Torres pushing it. Queensboro will keep it. Langley will inbound. Harris being guarded by DeCutis. Torres left alone. Three. Out of bounds. Kingsboro will have it. Kingsboro trying to push the lead to six or seven. Brown. Lost it. They cute us with it. Nice pass, and Brown hits. Essence Brown with her first points. It's now 19-13, Lady Wave. Harris. Harris off glass, rebounded by Latham, and a foul is called. Gabriel Fallon under 10, Essence Brown, her first, team third. Fallon, Essence Brown, Latham is at the line. Latham misses the first. In the game for QCC, number 30, Kalina Marshall, and number 35, Sabrina Rodriguez. Precious Latham, averaging 8.3 points per game. Also 10.7 rebounds per game. Latham splits the free throws, that's her first point. It's now 19-14, Lady Wave leading. Now four different Queensboro players have scored. Langley and Latham have one point apiece. Brown with it. Hey, Cutis. Rodriguez is over. Traveling is called. Queensboro will have it with 8.35 remaining in the first. Yeah. 
Team Burroughs, substitution number 20, Samantha Mansour, replacing number 25, Dick Diaz. Rodriguez brings it up. And watch after this possession, when Queensboro goes back on defense, if they're going to press. Rodriguez to Torres. Torres. Worked for a higher percentage shot, still missed it, but rebounded by Rodriguez. Latham to Torres. From in front of the bleachers, misses. Rodriguez, off glass, it's good. Rodriguez now with 10. It's 19-16 with under eight minutes to go. Lost it, Rodriguez with it. Rodriguez. Couldn't finish. Rodriguez with the putback. Keanu Jean Lewis missed it. Now Rodriguez off glass. <laughs> Sabrina Rodriguez with a dozen points. And traveling is called. <laughs> Queensboro trailing 19-18. But they have the ball and they have the momentum with 737 remaining in the first. Number 11, Brown. Good ball denial. Torres gets it to Rodriguez, who gets it to Latham. Keanu Jean Lewis to Latham. Back to Keanu Jean Lewis. And Queensboro will keep it. Heads up play by Rodriguez to save it in. Torres. Air balls a three. And Latham with it. Precious Latham, Queensboro looking for the lead. Torres for three. This time it's good. Jacqueline Torres with her first three points of the game. Queensboro leads 21-19 with under seven minutes to go in the first half. And Kingsboro answers back. Latoya Kinlock now has nine points and the game is tied at 21. Torres, Latham with it. Latham underneath, had nowhere to go. And here's the press. Baina to Kinlock. Couldn't finish with the layup. Loose ball. Kingsboro comes up with it. 6.25 remaining. Samantha Mansour with it to Baina. Jumper. Air ball. Jump ball, Jump ball is called. Kingsboro will keep it. 6.16 to go. Allison Ahmed with it. Almost a five second violation. Five second violation is called. Ahmed tried to call timeout. Didn't get it in time. The Kingsboro players, she asked for timeout but they didn't give it to her. All the players went to the bench thinking they did receive it. No timeout charged, but Queensboro has it back. Kalena Marshall to Torres. Torres for the lead, it's good! Jacqueline Torres. And Kingsboro calls for time. This one is granted, it's 24-21 with 6.04 to go in the first. Torres, who's averaging 10.3 points per game, now has six back-to-back -back threes. Sabrina Rodriguez leading the way for QCC with a dozen points. Torres with six. Lady Wave, Latoya Kinlock has nine points. Carla Baina has six. Kristen DeCutis with four. And Essence Brown with two. Tightly contested game as when they met 12 days ago. Kingsboro won by two points.
Kingsborough will pass Queensborough win the CUNY rankings with the win here. Queensborough is half a game in front of them right now. Four and one in CUNY as compared to four and two for Kingsborough. Of course, Kingsborough with the win would be five and two, half a game ahead of Queensborough. Kingsborough can't allow Torres to heat up. Lady Tigers lead 24-21, 6.04 to go. Kingsborough with it. See what they come out with after the timeout. Throws up a wild one, Kinlock. Queensboro with it, Torres. Kinlock hits the floor. Kalena Marshall to Sabrina Rodriguez. Rodriguez. Keanu Jean Lewis's shot is sent away. And traveling is called. Quite a fall. Allison Ahmed. Is able to get up under her own power. Game turning into a rugby scrum. Sabrina Rodriguez is the intended target. Torres will try to get it to her with the cutest. Well, they don't try to get to Rodriguez. Marshall, don't know what that was. Tipped. Kingsborough with it. They can cut the lead to one or even tie the game. 2-3 zone defense. Tip stolen. Lady Tigers with it now. Rodriguez under five minutes to play in the first half. And traveling is called. Bob DiNardo calling out the defensive play. They will press. Rodriguez guarding the inbound. Baina gets it. Akutis throws it ahead to Kinlock. Baina, that's a two. Missed. Essence Brown, shot was altered. Loose ball. Sabrina Rodriguez with it for Queensboro. Now Kalena Marshall with it. And then Torres in the corner for Queensboro. Kalena Marshall to Rodriguez. Torres for three. Long rebound by the Lady Tigers. Precious Latham with it. Keanu Jean Lewis. And a foul is called, it'll be on Essence Brown. That's foul number two on Brown. Fourth team foul on Kingsboro. The other ones are on Carla Baina and Latoya Kinlock. Rodriguez inbounding. Precious Latham with it to Torres. Marshall had it tipped. Rodriguez with it. Nice pass. It's a three pointer. Gene Lewis misses though. Brown under four minutes to play. Kristen DeCutis. QCC leads 24-21, 3.44 to go in the first. That would have tied the game, it's rebounded by Latham. And a reach-in foul is called, I believe. Foul is on Samantha Mansour. Latasha Harris with it. Latham, turnaround jumper. Missed, rebounded by Baina. Decutis. Yeah. 
Two, three defense again. Foul on Queensboro. Second team foul. UCC foul number 32, Deanna D. Lewis. Our first team second. The injured Queensboro player is Jacqueline Torres. There is blood from the cut as they towel off the court. to go in the first. Lady Tigers lead 24-21. Torres being attended to on the bench by the trainer. Trying to stop the bleeding. Can't resume play until the blood is wiped off the floor. This Torres put some blood out. I'm not exactly sure where the cut occurred. Trying to figure out if they should use a towel. Torres who's averaging 10.3 points per game, 6.4 rebounds per game. 2.2 assists and steals per game. Huh. And play resumes. Brown chases it down. Take Hudis to Mansour. And traveling is called. Ball to QCC with 3.06 to play. And a huddle around the Queensboro bench, including the athletic director, Pete Marchitello, all attending to Jacqueline Torres. Latham. Tabitha Moore is called for traveling. Ball back to Kingsboro. Kinlock, DeCutis throws it up ahead to Baina. Baina turnaround jumper. QCC controls it, 2.40 to go. Sabrina Rodriguez. Kiana Jean Lewis to Latasha Harris. Harris makes her move. No basket, traveling is called. Two twenty six to go. Baina underneath off glass, it's good. She now has eight points, twenty four twenty three, QCC leads. Torres still sitting on the bench. Whole crowd around her. Queensboro looking to advance the lead and they do. Kiana Jean Lewis with her first points of the game. QCC leads 26-23. One forty-nine to go in the first. QCC foul number 24 at the Morris. Her first team third, Paula Bayana at the line for two. Bayana at the line for two. Tabitha Moore is called for the foul. First free throw is good. Second free throw would give her 10 points. And she hits it, 
Lady Tigers lead. 105 seconds to go in the first. Tabitha Morris, shot is blocked. Essence Brown with it. It hit Kinlock in the face. Out of bounds. It'll stay with KCC. 90 seconds to go. Mansoor. The cutest for the lead. Out of bounds. QCC ball. Latasha Harris. Loose ball, Kingsboro. Now with 65 seconds to go in the first half. Out of bounds, ball to QCC. 57 and 3, 10 seconds to go in the first. One minute to go in the first half. Latasha Harris. 52 seconds to go and counting. Harris. Keanu Jean Lewis back to Harris. Harris throws one up, tipped. Wave them underneath. Shot is sent away, chased down by Tabitha Morris, who's tripped, no foul is called. Rodriguez works her way out of a double team at half court. Rodriguez off glass, couldn't finish, Latham. Jump ball. And the jump ball is called. <laughs> Lady Tigers will keep it. They could, hold for, they could hold for the final shot if they choose. 28 and 6, 10 seconds remain. Rodriguez gets it into Latasha Harris. Tabitha Morris. That jumper was taken by Kiana Jean Lewis. Now Kingsboro can hold for the final shot. Down to 12 seconds to go. Mansoor. Rebounded by Latasha Harris. This could be it. Down to four. Three, Kiana Jean Lewis. Layup is good. Keanu Jane Lewis beats the buzzer, and at halftime, QCC leads 28-25. Sabrina Rodriguez leading the way with a dozen points. Second half set to begin, Queensboro leading 28-25. Kingsboro will have the ball. Jacqueline Torres will not come back for QCC. Decutis to Baina. Tie up. Jump ball. Jump ball called. Rodriguez caused the tie up. Latasha Harris with it. Harris to Rodriguez. Keanu Jean Lewis misses. Rebounded by Kinlock. Another Lady Wave player hits the floor. Out of bounds to QCC. Lady Tigers ball. Seems whenever these teams meet, it goes right down to the wire. Harris misses. Loose ball. Jump ball. Jump ball is called. Ball to KCC. 52 seconds into the second half. No scoring yet. Hillary Roman. Roman leading the team with 11 and a half points per game, but she was scoreless in the first half. Roman with it now. They cued us. Shot was altered. Precious Latham with it. And another jump ball is called. 
So third jump ball in the first 73 seconds of the half. Saying there should be 29 on the shot clock, not 30. Rodriguez with it. Full court pressure. Nice moves by Latasha Harris, and Harris couldn't finish. Kinlock. Kinlock taking it herself, then slows it up. Dacutis, off glass, it's good. Six points for Dacutis. 28-27, QCC leads. Latasha Harris. Foul is called. Team for foul number 31, Hillary Romain. Her first team first. Rodriguez pushing it. Rodriguez shot is blocked. Kingsborough looking to take the lead. A little over two minutes into the second half. Kinlock. Traveling by Lee. Traveling is called. By the time we're done, we might set the record for traveling violations in a game. Combined. Rodriguez. Pass stolen by Kinlock. It was intended for Keanu Jean Lewis. And Rodriguez with the steal. Rodriguez coast to coast. She now has 14 points. Those are her first two of the second half. 30-27, QCC leads. Kingsborough can tie it here. Kinlock. Down to eight on the shot clock. Kinlock. Down to four, three, two. Shot is put up, too strong, tipped. Out of bounds to QCC. Football. 17 minutes and eight seconds to go. Langley. Latasha Harris. Rodriguez with it now. 15 on the shot clock. Langley. To Keanu Jean Lewis, air ball. Rebounded by the Lady Wave. And Rodriguez sends it away. Kingsborough will keep it with 24 on the shot clock. Samantha Mansour is in. And Aaliyah Moore is out. Hillary Romain for the tie. Missed. Latasha Harris with it. Up ahead to Rodriguez to Precious Latham. And a jump ball is called. Kingsborough with it. 16.20 to go. 30-27, Lady Tigers lead. Mansoor. Bain a turn around. Rodriguez with it now. Kingsborough with it now. A little over four minutes into the second half. Spin move by Decudis. Three pointer was missed. Put back is good. Samantha Monsur with her first points of the game. It's 30-29, Lady Tigers. Precious Latham. And traveling is called. 15.30 to go. Kingsborough will have it. Looking for the lead. Number 10, Essence Brown. We're playing number 11, Latoya Kinlock. Yeah. 
point guard, Kristen. They cue this. Kingsboro looking for the lead. Romaine, Langley guarding her. Down to 15 on the shot clock, and now Queensboro has it. Traveling is called. Lady Wave will have it. Romaine for the lead. Tipped. Keanu Jean Lewis with it for the Lady Tigers. Latasha Harris now. Harris. Shifted into another gear and got fouled. Second foul on Samantha Mansour. At the line for QCC, number 22, Latasha Harris, shooting two. First free throw is good for Harris. She now has five points. Harris splits the free throws, Mansoor with it. Pushes it to Romaine. Kingsboro can tie or take the lead. Dekutis to Mansoor, takes it inside. Kick out to Romaine for the lead. Missed, rebounded. Put back is good. Mansoor ties it at 31. Five and a half minutes into the second. Rodriguez, inbound being guarded. Kalena Marshall with it. Rodriguez to Harris. Harris finishes. Latasha Harris with seven points. QCC leads 33-31 with 14-15 to go and a full timeout is called. Keeper called timeout is a full timeout. Rodriguez has 14 for Queensboro. Latasha Harris with seven. Jacqueline Torres is out with six. In their last game, Kingsboro lost to BMCC, 45-44. That was two nights ago. Play set to resume. Queensboro up 33-31. 14 minutes, 15 seconds remain. Kingsboro with the ball. Kinlock, turnaround jumper off glass is good. Kinlock matching her jersey with 11 points. 33-33, Rodriguez. Gives the lead back to the Lady Tigers. Rodriguez now with 16 points. 35-33, QCC. Essence Brown. Long rebound by Kingsboro, and then Rodriguez. Rodriguez was pushed out. 
That's the third foul on Samantha Mansour. Langley misses. Dakotis with it. Rodriguez was on her and then a steal. And Rodriguez may have pushed off. Rodriguez. Gets it to Latasha Harris under 13 minutes to play. Harris is fouled. That was on Latoya Kinlock. That's her second. Good news for Queensboro. Not only is Kingsboro committed 14 fouls this half, Queensboro hasn't committed one. The line for Harris hits the first free throw. Makes them both. Harris has nine points and Queensboro leads 37-33. And a steal, Rodriguez. Loose ball chased down by the Lady Wave. And a jump ball is called. Harris tied up Dakutis. Twelve forty two to play. Lady Tigers have the ball. Underneath Marshall. He goes out of bounds. The Lady Tigers will keep it. Kristen Dekudis will come out. Shakia Johnson is in. Rodriguez trying to get it in. Gets it to Kiana Jean Lewis, to Harris, to Marshall, back to Harris. Langley. Lost it. Out of bounds. Queensboro will have it with 15 on the shot clock. Harris, Langley, that's a three, it's good. Elise Langley from downtown. And Queensboro leads 40-33. That gets the crowd excited. Kingsboro can't answer back. Kinlock. Rodriguez chases it down. And now she's going to try to go coast to coast and a reach in Ballas' call. Momentum slipping away from the Lady Wave. 11.54 to play. Non-shooting foul. Team foul number five on Kingsborough. Traveling violation on Queenborough. This may be a shock, but a traveling violation is called. 11.52 to play. Samantha Mansour crossing half court. Kinlock goes baseline, and a foul is called. Only the first team foul committed by the Lady Tigers. Queensboro foul number 22, Latasha Harris, her first team first. Kingsboro looking to cut into the lead. Romaine not even close, but then the putback is also no good. Johnson looked like she had a very clean look at it. Lady wave with it. Baina. That was a line drive shot. Rebounded by the Lady Tigers and Langley. 
Bob DiNardo calls a 30 second timeout with 11 minutes and 21 seconds left to play. Queensboro leads 40-33. They've scored 12 of the 20 points in this half. Rodriguez, Latasha Harris for three. Almost went in off glass. And Harris jump ball. Kingsborough will have it after the jump ball, alternating possession. Hits, hits. Approaching 11 minutes left to play. Baina, nice pass, off glass. Samantha Mansour now with six points. 40-35, QCC leads. 10.45 to go. Latasha Harris to lay them. Lost it momentarily. Harris to Langley. Kiana Jean Lewis to Harris, down to 10 on the shot clock. Kiana Jean Lewis. And Kingsborough comes away with it. 10.25 and counting remaining in the second half. Mansour. Mansour guarded by Rodriguez. Gets it to Kinlock. And a foul is called. Kinlock is at the line. The foul is on Latasha Harris. At the line for Kingsborough, Latoya Kinlock, shooting two. Second team foul by Queensboro this half. Kinlock is at the line. Hits the first. Kinlock now with a dozen points. Number 25, Ty Irby. Number 31, Lee Splits the free throws. Kinlock gets her own rebound. Tipped. And Latham comes down with it for QCC. Latasha Harris. 40-36, Queensboro leads. A legal screen. Kingsborough will have it. Ten minutes, four seconds remain. Kristen DeCudis is back in for Kingsborough, number five. Number five, Kristen DeCudis in the game for Kingsborough. And she has it now, crossing half court. Under ten minutes to go in the second. Baina has it, and Rodriguez. Queensboro will have it on the alternating possession. <laughs> Latasha Harris with it. <laughs> Naisha Irby. Dangerous pass, Harris has it. Kiana Jane Lewis, off glass, it rims out. Latham with the putback, it's good. Precious Latham with the first field goal. She now has three points. QCC leads 42-36. Nine minutes and 20 seconds remain. Mansour to cut the lead in half, and she does. Mansour now has nine points. 42-39, 9.07 to go. Irby. 
Shot is blocked by Baina. Rodriguez to Latasha Harris. Keanu Jean Lewis. Jean Lewis throws up a wild one. Mansoor pushing it for the Lady Wave. Dekudis. Air balls at three. Baina underneath is fouled. QCC foul on number 42, Precious Latham, her first heat foot. At the line for a Kingsborough, Carla Bayana, shooting two. Baina misses the first free throw. Baina with 10 points. Misses them both. Tipped, chased down by Latham. Latasha Harris with it now. Naija Irby. Out of bounds, it'll stay with QCC. 8.31 to play. Kingsborough substitution, number 32, Allison Ahmed. Replacing number 25, Jakia Johnson. Harris. Latham. Keanu Jean Lewis for three. It's good. Keanu Jean Lewis now with seven points. 45-39, Queensboro lead. Hakuda steps into a three, and she answers back. She now has nine points. 45-42, Queensboro leads. Now under eight minutes to play. Keanu Jean Lewis. Naija Irby left alone underneath. Irby with their first points of the game. And then the delay of game is called on Precious Latham. 47-42, Queensboro leads. Three-pointer. Rebounded by Harris. Harris. Keanu Jean Lewis, back to Harris. Under seven and a half to play. Harris underneath, it's good. Latasha Harris now with the 11 points. 49-42, Queensboro leads with seven minutes and 15 seconds and counting. Baina picks it up and shoots and hits. Baina with a dozen points, it's 49-44. Rodriguez. Out of bounds, it'll stay with QCC, 6.57 left. Rodriguez gets it to Harris. Keanu Jean Lewis goes baseline. And traveling is called. Kingsboro trying to cut into the lead. Kinlock. Tie up is called. Jump ball. Lady Wave will have it. Allison Ahmed gets it in. Nice backdoor play. Couldn't finish though. Sabrina Rodriguez. Rodriguez ahead of the pack. And she finishes. Rodriguez now with 18 points. Queensboro now with the 51 44 lead. 6.20 left to play. Good job by Mansoor to make sure that one didn't go into the bleachers. Timeout. And a full timeout is taken by Kingsboro. With 6.15 left to play, Queensboro leads 51-44. Rodriguez leading the way with 18. 
Latasha Harris with the 11. down by seven. See what they come out with out of the timeout. Ahmed, good ball movement. Baina, couldn't hit. And a tie-up is called. This whole game has been filled with tie-ups and traveling violations. Now under six minutes to play. Queensboro trying to hold on to a seven-point lead and remain first in the CUNY standings. Also remember the CUNY tournament will be played here. Precious Latham, good team defense, and there's a steal. Kinlock loses it. It will stay with KCC. Kingsboro fans are not happy that a foul wasn't called. Mansoor with it. Kinlock, way off. And another tie up, Kingsboro will have it. Kingsboro ball. Shot, long rebound. Tipped. Out of bounds, it'll stay with KCC. Dekutis, 5.15 to go. Mansoor, Baina, Swing and pass, Dekutis finishes down low. Dekutis now has 11 points. 51-46 Queensboro, under five minutes to play. Rodriguez. Keanu Jean Lewis has to go through her hands. Lady Wave have it under five minutes to play. Dekutis, 4.45 to go. Dekutis, Ahmed is fouled. Good call. Foul is on Latasha Harris. QCC foul on number 22, Latasha Harris, her third, deep fifth. Allison Ahmed at the line for King for shooting two. Harris's third foul. Allison Ahmed looking for her first points. If she hits both free throws, it would be a one possession game. That point is moot now.
Miss, missed it. Corner pressure. Jump ball. Jump ball is called. Queensboro with it up by five, under 4.30 to go. Harris. Harris is fouled. Two shot foul as Kinlaw commits her third foul. With four minutes and 24 seconds to go. Harris misses the first. Free throws so critical down the stretch of so many games. Harris hits the second. Now has a dozen points. It's 52-46, 4.20 to go. Mansoor, three-pointer, couldn't hit. Kinlock, foul is committed. 4.10 to go. QCC foul number 32, Kiana Jean Lewis. Second. second foul on Kiana Jane Lewis. Kinlock hits the first free throw. She now has 13 points. 52-47. Kinlock misses, but it's rebounded by Baina, and it's good. Carla Baina now at 14 points. Queensboro, the lead is down to one possession. 52-49 with under four minutes to go. Keanu Jean Lewis for three. Chase down, it's out of bounds. I thought Irby might chase it down for a moment. Kingsboro pushing it. Last year when these two teams met, right here, Queensboro won in overtime. Harris to Rodriguez. Rodriguez. Nice, tr nice transition defense was played. QCC has it, 3.28 to go. Replaces number 25 by Asia Irby. Latham. Left her feet to make a pass, which she never do. And then she just throws it away. Allison Ahmed just threw it away. Queensboro with it. Latham. Mid-range jumper. Missed it. Rebounded by Kinlock. In for a furious finish. Baina, pass is thrown away with 3.02 to go. <laughs> Queensboro will have it, 3.02 to go. And Bob DiNardo calls a full timeout. When these teams met a dozen days ago, Kingsboro won 66-64. Can Queensboro exact revenge? <laughs> Latasha Harris has a dozen points. Sabrina Rodriguez with 18. Jacqueline Torres, who hasn't played in the second half. Because of an injury, left the game with six points. Keanu Jean Lewis with seven. <laughs> Carla Baina with 14 points for the Lady Wave. Latoya Kinlock with 13. Kristen DeCutis. 
with 10. Three minutes, two seconds remaining. 52-49, Queensboro lead. And the Lady Tigers have the ball. Harris, Keanu Jean Lewis back to Harris. Under three minutes to play. Latasha Harris. Sabrina Rodriguez. Tabitha Morris. Keanu Jean Lewis to Rodriguez, down to 12. Morris. Rodriguez, down to seven on the shot clock. Rodriguez, underneath, throws up a wild one. Put back is good. Keanu Jean Lewis. 54-49, Queensboro lead. Two minutes, 20 seconds to go. Mansour, baseline, couldn't hit. Kinlock with the rebound, tipped, loose ball. Traveling is called. Traveling is called and KCC has it. Baina, jumper, rebounded by Latham. Now Latasha Harris with it. Up ahead to Tabitha Morris, under two minutes to play. Queensboro nursing a five point lead. Sabrina Rodriguez, see if they run some time off here. Latasha Harris, tough shot, tipped. Stepped out of bounds, Kingsboro will have it with 105 seconds to go in regulation. Clock doesn't start until she touches it. Dekudis. Facing the zone defense. Kinlock, it's a three. And it rims out, but Baina, her shot is blocked. Tipped, Mansour puts it back, can't finish. And Kingsborough with another chance. Counted and the foul. Fifty-four, fifty-one. QCC substitution number thirty, Melina Marshall, replacing number twenty-four, Tabitha Morris. Offense, defense substitutions for Queensboro. This is a free throw. Rodriguez with it. Under 80 seconds to play. Latasha Harris to Rodriguez. Marshall, Keanu Jean Lewis. Almost threw it away, Rodriguez. Loose ball and a foul is called. Refs discuss it. Foul is on Kalena Marshall. Kalena Marshall can't believe the foul is called on her. Kinlock, it's a one in one situation. Misses the first, rebounded by Marshall. And the foul is called with exactly one minute to play. Fourth foul on Kinlock, one more and she's done. Alina Marshall at the line for a QCC, shooting one and one.
Marshall misses the front end of a one and one. Kingsborough rebounds. The cutest. Mansour for the tie. Got her own rebound. Retreats to the three point line. The cutest. Nice pass. Baina can't hit. And a foul is called. Lady Tigers cannot buy a rebound. And the foul is on Sabrina Rodriguez. With 38 and 8, 10 seconds remaining. Sabrina Rodriguez, her second team's night. Allison Amanda Duran for a deep throw, three two. Allison Ahmed looking for her first point, and she has it. 54-52. Also wonder strategy-wise, would Kingsboro foul? Or, because it it's a one-on-one -one situation, so would they foul, or would they just play 30 seconds of defense? Ahmed, way up on the second. And a steal. with 33 and 9, 10 seconds. Second foul on Carla Baina. Kalena Marshall at the line, looking for her first points of the game. If she misses the first, Kingsborough will have it with a chance to tie or take the lead. Misses, rebounded by Keanu Jean Lewis. Latasha Harris. And Bob DiNardo calls a timeout with 28 and 110 seconds remaining. Three second difference between the game clock and the shot clock. Full timeout taken. So for Kingsboro, as Bob DiNardo talks to assistant David Chambers, what do you do? Do you foul? Or do you just play straight up defense or do you press? Oh, so what do you do if you're Queensboro? Do you just take the first available shot? Do you try something quick? I think I would try to run down the clock. Bob DiNardo also reminding his team that they have two full timeouts left, so if there's a press, they can call one. Twenty-eight and one ten seconds to go. Queensboro up fifty-four fifty-two. Latasha Harris will inbound. Rodriguez has it. Rodriguez. Double comes over. Langley with it. Langley gets it back to Rodriguez. To Harris. And Harris is fouled. Refs have a word. Fifteen and four, ten seconds remaining. Fourth foul on Samantha Mansour. One more and she's gone. Critical if this goes to overtime that two lady wave players have four fouls. First free throw is good. Latasha Harris with 13 points. If she makes this one, it's a two possession game. If not, it's still a three point game. And what do you do if you're Bob DiNardo? Do you have your team commit a foul so that they can't shoot a three? Or do you just play straight up defense? Bob DiNardo will probably call timeout. If that was good, 
Lekoudis is out of bounds and Queensboro will get it back with 13 and 9, 10 seconds remaining. What a break for the Lady Tigers. Harris trying to get it in, flips it. Dangerous pass, Rodriguez chases it down and she is fouled with 10 and 5, 10 seconds. As Bob DiNardo nearly had a heart attack on that one. I think all the Lady Tigers' hearts skipped a few beats with that pass. Team girl foul on number five, Kristen Decoudis, her first beat 10. Only the first foul on Kristen Decoudis. Sabrina Rodriguez at the line. One of these free throws would make it a two possession game. Misses the first. Things will get very interesting if she misses this one. Then Kingsboro still has a chance to tie. Lane violation. Inexcusable. They won't get the second free throw off and Kingsborough will have it with the chance to tie. Completely inexcusable for the Lady Tigers. Now Kingsborough with the chance to tie the game and now all the options. Ten and five, ten seconds remaining. Now if Queensboro wants to foul, it's very dangerous because one of the Lady Wave players could be in the act of shooting and get three free throws. Or the worst case scenario, Armageddon would be one of the Lady Wave players hitting a three and then going to the line for a four point play on the foul. Try to commit a foul before the three pointer is taken, in which case it would be two free throws and then Kingsborough would have to hit the first and then miss the second to get it back. So much strategy right now. These teams never play a boring game. Kingsborough has a 20 second timeout remaining. So just in case one of them is trapped or whatever the situation may be. Remember college and high school as well. You have to go the full length of the court. As opposed to the NBA, you call a timeout, you could advance it to half court. She balls it right to Langley. Unbelievable. With nine seconds to go. And now they're gonna give it back to Kingsborough. Kingsboro gets away with one. They could have slid it right to Langley. But then the refs give it back to Kingsboro. I'm not sure what Kingsboro is going to do on this possession, but I can guarantee you it won't involve De Kuda sliding the ball or rolling it just to save a few seconds. Looked like Langley was fouled and that she would go to the line to try to ice the game. Nobody guarding the inbound. To Mansoor. Eight, seven, six, throws up a three. Miss, tipped. And Dekuda shoots. Latasha Harris. That's it. Queensboro wins 55-52. Dekudis made a mistake, she got the offensive rebound. And instead of resetting, she tried to shoot a two. This is QCC student David Russell. Lady Tigers take it 55-52.